Hello friends, once again welcome to Daily Electrical YouTube channel. Our today's topic is PMDC motor or Permanent Magnet DC motor. In this topic, we shall discuss about the difference between normal DC motor and a permanent magnet DC motor and what are the applications of permanent DC motor in our day to day life. Now let us begin. You know friends, there is two important part in any DC motor. Number one is field and number two is the armature. As per the electromagnetic law. Whenever a current carrying conductor is placed inside a magnetic field, the conductor experiences a force, mechanical force, which is used to generate a torque and for this torque, the shaft starts rotating. Now in case of normal DC motor, there is a field coil and one armature conductor. Because of this field coil, an electromagnetic induction is there and electromagnetic field is generated and the armature works like a closed conductor which uh, when the current passes through the armature it starts rotating in reaction with the field flux but in case of PMDC motor no field coil is used instead of field coil to generate the magnetic flux we use permanent magnets here let us check the PMDC motor construction by seeing the intersite of real PMDC motor this is the PMDC motor with operated by 6 volt DC now inside a real PMDC motor, there is the main part, the armature coil. The armature constructed by steel core laminations and here we use the copper wire to pull the coil. And as you can see, inside a PMDC motor, there is two permanent magnets used. One is south pole and another is north pole and the armature is inserted in this way here are carbon brushes and we apply the potential difference in these two terminals explain the working principle of a PMDC motor inside a PMDC motor as you seen in practical there is two field permanent magnets south pole and north pole and a magnetic flux is generated from south to north. Now whenever you apply a potential difference of 6 volt, say 6 volt potential difference is applied, then a current IA will start flowing through the armature coil. And now this armature is acting like a current carrying conductor placed inside a magnetic field. Because of the electromagnetic law, automatically the armature will experience a mechanical force which induce a torque inside and will start to rotate the motor shaft. Now coming to the next point, speed control. How we can control the speed of a PMDC motor? In normal DC motor, we can control in two ways. To generate the, to control the field fluxes by implementing the current concept by increasing or decreasing. But in PMDC motor, you cannot control the field flux because here the fields are already fixed by permanent magnets. Here you can only control the armature current. The armature current you have to control and you can do this by increasing or decreasing this potential difference applying in two terminals. By increasing the potential difference, high amount of armature current will start flow and the motor speed will be increased. Discuss what are the advantages of PMDC motor. Number one, PMDC motor do not use any field coil. In this way, their efficiency is increased. Number two, as no field coil is used, so the space required is very small as compared with other conventional DC motors. Now, what are the applications of PMDC motor? The permanent magnet DC motors are used in several segments of domestic applications, in low voltage applications like toy industry, several toys, robots, portable vacuum cleaners, food mixtures, portable electric tools like drills, trimmers, etc. Because as the size is very smaller as compared to other DC motors, 
we can use in many portable devices which is operated by DC battery. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any query then just put your comment to our comment section and like our videos and also subscribe our videos to get the daily updates on electrical knowledge. Thanks for watching our video.